in our daily life, we might need to transfer data from our mobile phones to our computer or from our computer to mobile phones without using any USB data cables. How can we do that? In our case, we will be demonstrating that using Android phone. So let's get started. So first thing first, we need to launch our Play Store and we need to install one application on our Android phone. And we can simply search with CX File Explorer. And you can use any other tool for that matter. But CX File Explorer is small and it is good. As you see, it's just 6.2 MB for this Android version and click on install. Now my app is installed. I can click on open directly from here and here is privacy policy. I'm clicking next and obviously it needs file access. Click on next and you need to allow all file access and you can allow this notification as well and we are good to go. And in our case, we do not install anything on our computer. Only this application is installed on our phone. And let me turn off my Wi-Fi because without data cable, we are going to transfer it. So we will be leveraging the hotspot capability of this. Let me turn on mobile hotspot. And from CX Explorer, we can go to network, then access from the yellow color. Just click on that and we do not want random password we want to set our password and you can provide any port so for example maybe 1212 something like that and we can specify our own password something like that 123456 then click on start service and remember this works for if you are connected to a wi-fi network that means your laptop or computer is connected to a wi-fi network and your phone is also connected to the same wi-fi network it will look exactly same in our case we are transferring via hotspot and you'll see some text is given over on my screen ftp colon double slash one ip address then colon one two one two that is the port number which we have given don't worry about these technical stuffs i'll let you know how easily we can integrate that on our computer and you will see one username and password is there and you can even click on home and you can do whatever you like on your android phone and from the notification you will see it is running now let's switch our screen on our computer now on our computer what i have to do i have to basically go into the wi-fi mode and connect to that hotspot which we have shared from our mobile phone i have already connected that that is simple just click on connect and provide your password then what i need to do I need to go into my computer then on home screen of my computer or explorer file explorer just right click and click on add network location click on next and choose a custom network location that is selected already click on next then I need to provide that value which we have seen in our mobile phone console so that is ftp colon double slash 192.168 253.95 then as it is you just copy it then click next and obviously on our screen we have one username and password that is why I will be unchecking this that means I need one username and password PC which is shown on your screen click on next and you can provide a logical naming of that maybe or that is optional then click on next keep this checkbox ticked that means whenever I finish this it will try to open my phone or basically the drive from my phone click on finish it will pop up one window here I need to provide my password my password is 123456 and make sure save password is checked otherwise every time you go into this folder you have to provide the password which we do not want obviously click on log on and you see something is showing on my screen which is called device and I can copy anything from my phone this is basically my phone for example if I go to movies and maybe I can copy this just select that one right click copy or maybe you can use Control C as well and let me go to my desktop and paste it copy has been started it is going wirelessly and the file is copied for example now I want to copy something from my computer to our mobile device now for example, I want to copy this PDF file. Maybe I can right click, copy. I can go into my computer under network locations. If it is hidden, you can click on this little arrow button. You'll see that is already mounted. Double click on that. Go to your device. And from there, in 
whatever folder you want to copy you can copy that for example maybe das learning paste that here file is already copied over here so this is just a simple exercise and if you want to delete this particular network location from your computer click on that click on delete and it is gone you can refresh now now on our mobile phone if we go to that cx explorer or maybe drag your notification window then go there you'll see that is still running make sure that is running otherwise your copy will not work you can stop the service and you can go back and you can go into your local storage now for example we have copied that pdf file and i can go into that folder that pdf was cancellation rules and you can click on that and maybe i can open with any software and that's all and as we have seen it is really easy to set up this one we, we do not need wi-fi router we do not need usb cable only one application on our phone and no application is required on your computer side thanks for watching see you in some next quick amazing videos